Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, we're going to deploy this application on Oracle's always free tier. Uh, but first, let's create uh, the instance. Now, uh, let's rename the instance to nginx demo. And we're going to use the image um, Oracle Linux 8, you can, but you can use other images like Ubuntu, CentOS, and Windows Server. Also, let's download the private key and public keys that we are going to use to SSH into the instance. So the instance is provisioning. Let's wait for it to start running. Okay, it is running now. Let's copy the IP address um, and try to SSH into the instance. But firstly, let's uh, change the permissions on the key. And now let's SSH into the instance. All right, uh, let's update the system. Now this process is going to take longer. I'm just gonna pause the video then come back once everything's done. All right, uh, the update is complete. Um, let's move to the next section. All right, now let's install Nginx and Git. We're going to use Git to clone the, the repo that we're going to use in this demo. Right, Nginx is installed. Okay, now let's add HTTP to our firewall and also reload the firewall changes. And also let's go to our ingress and add uh, ingress rules to allow us to access um, the instance using port 80. So I've already added the pod, yeah, but you can add a, a pod or you can add an ingress rule like here. It's a pretty simple. So now let's enable Nginx. So this command is going to enable Nginx and start the server. Now we can access the, the server here, but let's clone the repo that we're going, we're going to use in this demo and move it to Nginx directory. So now we're going to move everything from that, from that repo into our Nginx HTML directory. I just need to use sudo here. Alrighty. Uh, let's see if we can access the server, but let's restart the server first. Then we'll go to the browser and see if we can access the application. The application is up and running. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.